Welcome students, this is me. My name is Bobby Ann Durr, but you can just call me Miss B. Buzz Buzz. I am from Kentucky and I buzzed my way down here to Houston to get my PhD. I love to play basketball and I love statistics and I love teaching so I hope you enjoyed this course hey students I told you a little bit about me and now it's your turn go on to the phase one discussion board and tell me about you you can find the discussion board link on blackboard either in the phase one folder or there's a link to all discussion boards on the left hand side you can write a little blurb about yourself, or you can play two truths and a lie with me. Write two truths and a lie, and I'll try to guess which one is the lie. Also, play with other classmates and try to guess which statement is their lie. The reason for the discussion boards are to have you interact with me and your fellow classmates. Interaction online is critical for an online course because we will not be meeting face to face and we lose that in-person interaction. If there's no interaction, you might feel isolated. However, you are not alone. Your classmates and I are here to help. You should know there are 12 phases to the course and for each phase, you must write at least three times on the discussion board. You can ask questions or respond to other posts, and this will all count toward your three post minimum. There are no strict requirements for a post. They just need to be respectful to others and class relevant. The main point of the discussion boards is to have students interact with each other. The course content discussed on the discussion boards is student driven, and that's what I want. After the discussion board, finish the other assignments in the phase one folder. They are numbered, so you'll know what order to finish your assignments in. Due dates can be found by clicking on each assignment. You can also find a list of all due dates on the calendar. For each phase, you should complete the discussion board, the learning module, and the homework. We have ready to discuss the discussion boards. The learning modules are designed to teach you that phase's learning objectives. The learning modules refer to the YouTube videos and the multiple choice or fill in the number type questions. The YouTube videos are embedded in each assignment and you can find them on my YouTube channel. You might want to, want to subscribe to my channel so you can review some of the videos before an exam. The videos are often created by me, but I also have links to quality videos created by other YouTubers. If you have a Chromecast, you can cast the videos right on your TV. Make sure you take notes during the videos, just like you would in an in-person course. Pausing the video when you need to slow down, rewinding videos when you do not understand something, taking screenshots, and using OneNote to take your notes may help you be successful in this course. This week, the learning module is split up into multiple parts. For phase one, we will cover why statistics is useful, the syllabus, and math you should refresh on before we start learning new material. The homeworks refer to the Word documents you will turn in. We will go into more detail about the homeworks and other class requirements in the syllabus video for now. Just follow the numbers 